Hello everyone, in this video we will solve a nice exponential equation a to the power 5 minus 32 is equal to 0 we will find out a is equal to what? how to solve this question? how to solve this exponential equation? first of all you can say here is a to the power 5 minus 32 so I take here is a to the power 5 and if I move on this 32 in this side it will be positive 32 then you can see here is a to the power 5 is equal to 32 it will be 2 to the power 5 now at this moment look here is exponent is same this 5 this 5 so you can see the base is same so here is a is equal to 2 this is our final answer this is the value of a in this exponential equation but this is real solution but at this moment we find out others four solution four root I mean this solution it, it will be complex solution so here is a to the power 5 minus 32 is equal to 0 a is equal to what we'll find out a is equal to 2 but now we'll find out others four root let's start here is a to the power 5 minus 32 is equal to 0 so a to the power 5 minus 2 to the power 5 is equal to 0 2 to the power 5 it will be 32 then if I divide both side 2 to the power 5 so i can see this expression a to the power 5 over 2 to the power 5 minus 1 is equal to 0 i divide both side 2 to the power 5 now at this moment you can see the here is a uh, exponent is same so you know that a to the power n over b to the power n is equal to a over v whole to the power n if i apply this complex rules here if I apply this exponential rule here, so it will be a over 2 whole to the power 5 minus 1 is equal to 0. So we'll find out here is nice exponential equation a over 2 whole to the power 5 minus 1 is equal to 0. So let a over 2 is equal to x. So I can see it will be x to the power 5 minus 1 is equal to 0. We are let this is equal to x. Now we know that x to the power n, we know that x to the power n minus 1, it will be x minus 1 times x to the power n minus 1 plus n minus 2 plus dot 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 and here is 1. So if I apply these rules here, so this is 5, so 5 minus 1, it will be 4, 5 minus 2, it will be 3, 5 minus 3, it will be 2. So I can see this expression, it will be x minus 1 times x to the power 4 plus x to the power 3 plus x to the power 2 plus x to the power 1 plus 1 is equal to 0. Now, at this moment, we we'll find out here is two case our first case x minus 1 is equal to 0 so I can say x minus 1 is equal to 0 and other case we will find out x to the power 4 plus x to the power 3 plus x to the power 2 plus x plus 1 is equal to 0 now here x minus 1 is equal to 0 so if I move on this one in this side it will be x is equal to 1 and recall we will add x is equal to a over 2 so I can say it will be a over 2 is equal to 1 then if I multiply both side by 2 we'll find out a is equal to 2 this is our real solution first of all we are find out this a is equal to 2 here now at this moment we are find out the other solution it will be x to the power 4 x cube plus x square plus x plus 1 is equal to 0 so I divide both side x square so it will be x to the power 4 over x square plus x to the power 3 over x square plus x square over x square plus x over x square plus 1 over x square is equal to 0. I divide both sides by x square. Now at this point you can see it will be x to the power 2. x to the power 4 divide x square it will be x to the power 2. And it will be x plus and it will be 1. This this cancel out. We will find out here is 1. And it will be 1 over x plus 1 over x square is equal to 0 now at this moment you can see easily here x square plus 1 over x square this x square plus 
1 over x squared plus x plus 1 over x plus 1 is equal to 0. Now this expression, you can see it will be x squared plus 1 over x squared. I take here is 2, then I again subtract this to 1 over x and negative 2 plus 1 is equal to 0. I add 2 and I again I subtract this to. Now here, you can see it will be x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 2. It will be x plus 1 over x whole to the power 2. You we'll know that? a plus b whole square it will be a square plus b square plus 2ab. According to this law, you can say it will be x plus 1 over x whole to the power 2 plus and x plus 1 over x here x plus 1 over x and minus 2 plus 1 it will be negative 2 sorry negative 1 is equal to 0. Now let x plus 1 over x is equal to m okay we are let this is equal to m. So you can see it will be m square plus m minus 1 is equal to 0. Now at this moment if I apply these rules I mean here m is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root v square minus 4 is u over 2a. If I apply this law here we are find out here is m is equal to it will be negative 1 plus minus square root 5 over 2 we are find out this value here it will be m is equal to minus 1 plus minus square root 5 over 2 so i can easily here is m is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 over 2 and others below m2 it will be m1 so okay minus 1 minus square root 5 over 2 now we know that m, m it, it will be x plus 1 over x. I put this value in this expression. So it will be x plus 1 over x is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 over 2. And here also x plus 1 over x minus 1 minus square root 5 over 2. Now at this moment I can see easily uh, here is the least common value is x. So it will be x squared plus 1 is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 over 2. Now here 2 times x square it will be 2 x square plus 2 times 1 it will be 2. And here is negative x plus square root 5x. Now you can see it will be 2 x square plus 2 plus x minus square root 5x is equal to 0. So we'll find out here is a nice quadratic equation. So at this point you can see easily here is 2x squared plus and here 1 minus square root 5 and here is x is common and plus 2 is equal to 0. Now at this point if I want to find out the value of x, so x is equal to, we know that it will be negative 1, I mean minus b plus minus square root v square minus 4 ac over 2a so you can say here x is equal to minus b it will be minus 1 minus square root 5 plus minus square root v square i mean minus 1 minus square root 5 whole square minus 4 ac over 2a 4 a is 2 a is 2 now here x is equal to you can see it will be minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus square root I mean b square so it will be uh, 1 minus 2 square root 5 plus 5 we know that a minus b square square minus 2ab plus b square and it will be 16 and here 4 and at this point you can see here is x is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus square root minus 10 minus 2 square root 5 over 4 now you can see easily here is x is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus square root 10 
plus 2 square root 5 i over 4. We know that here is minus 1 is common, so it will be 10 plus 2 square root 5 and square root minus 1 to be i. So we'll find out x is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus square root 10 plus square 2 square root 5 i over 4. Now recall x is equal to a over 2 and first of all we are let x is equal to a over 2. So if I take here is a over 2 so it will be minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus square root 10 plus 2 square root 5 i over 4 then this this it will be 2 so we are find out a is equal to minus 1 plus square root 5 plus minus this answer here is 2 answer 2 root but others case similarly we are find out 2 root, roots so here is it will be least common value x and here is x squared plus 1 this is equal to minus 1 minus square root 5 over 2 so if i find out here is uh, if I want to find out here is x is equal to what, so we'll find out here is x is equal to minus 1 minus square root 5 plus minus it will be 10 minus 2 square root 5 i over 4. Then if I take a x is equal to a over 2, then I can say this 2 divide this 4. I take here 4 minus 1 minus square root 5 plus minus square root 10 minus 2 square root 5i then if I divide this 4 by this 2 we are find out here is a is equal to 2 this 2 and minus 1 minus square root 5 plus minus square root 10 minus square root 5i this is others to answer so this is complex solution this is complex number so thank you all if you enjoyed this video please subscribe my channel for other interesting video goodbye take care